How to use the Facebook Pixel Helper The Facebook Pixel Helper works to automatically review the websites you browse for code that looks like a Facebook marketing pixel. When a website has a Facebook Pixel installed the icon will turn blue and a small badge will appear indicating pixels found on the page. If the icon does not turn blue then there are no Facebook pixels installed on this page. Click the icon and a small pop-up will appear with useful information for debugging your pixel implementation. How to install the Facebook Pixel Helper To use the Facebook Pixel Helper first make sure you are using the Chrome web browser on your computer. Next, using the Chrome browser install the Pixel Helper from the Chrome Store. Follow the instructions on the Chrome Store to install the extension in your browser. Once the Pixel Helper is installed a small icon will appear next to your address bar. Verifying your Facebook Pixel implementation. After installation, navigate to your websites in your Chrome browser and click on the Pixel Helper icon. The pop-up will tell what pixels were found on the page and whether they have loaded successfully. If your pixel loaded successfully, it's time to start running ads with them. Troubleshooting pixel errors. The Facebook Pixel Helper reports common errors. These states are indications that your webmaster needs to fix something in order to use the Facebook Pixel product properly. Pixel did not load. This error means that the Pixel Helper found what looks to be Facebook Pixel code on your site, but the actual HTTP call was never made. This could typically due to an error in the code, but could also occur if the Pixel fires on a dynamic event. In that case, the error will disappear upon clicking on the button. Encoded characters This error means that the Pixel Helper found what looks to be double encoded characters. This could typically due to a tag or CMS system encoding already encoded information, for example, encoding ampersand into an end. Please confirm that characters are not being encoded twice, for example, try changing ampersand to end. Resembles a standard event. This warning means that the Pixel Helper found a custom event that appears similar to a Facebook standard event. For example, ADDT cart instead of add to cart, we recommend using standard events when possible. For more information on planning event names, please see planning website custom audiences. Pixel activated multiple times. This error means that a pixel with the same ID and event name was sent multiple times to Facebook. This is typically an error. The same event should only occur once upon page loading. If it is sent with different custom data parameters, those parameters should be aggregated into a single pixel event. Invalid pixel ID This error means that the sent ID for the pixel did not match a known pixel ID in our system. Can't find product catalog. The product catalog ID which was passed in the field product catalog id in the pixel fire could not be found on our system. You can find your product catalog ID in Business Manager under Settings Product Catalogs. Alternatively to associate a product catalog to a pixel follow the steps below. Troubleshooting suggestions. The Facebook Pixel Helper also reports suggestions. These states are indications that the pixel is working but something could be changed to improve performance. You have opted out of tracking. This warning highlights that you have opted out of tracking from Facebook and the pixel fires detected were not logged on our servers. This prevents any server-side validation for the custom audience pixel potentially leaving pixel problems undiagnosed. You can learn more about our off-site tracking in your Facebook setting including how to turn tracking back on.
Facebook respects mobile device settings regarding advert tracking so you may need to update your device's settings to opt back in. If one or more device has opted out each device will have to opt back in before tracking is enabled. Pixel is not paired with a product catalog. This warning suggests that the Pixel is not paired with any product catalog. It is required to specify relationship between pixels and product catalogs. There are two ways to pair a catalog with a pixel in Business Manager. Go to https businessfacebookcom settings page. Choose product catalogs on the left pane. Press associate pixels button. Associate pixels with your product catalog. Via product catalog preferences API https developers.facebook.com slash docs slash marketing dash opi slash dynamic dash product dash ad slash product dash audiences slash pound product below preference s pixel took too long to load this warning suggests that it took a long amount of time before the pixel was activated this may be due to where the pixel is located on the page. If a web page visitor closes the page, clicks on the link, or navigates away before the pixel event activates, the action will not be tracked. A significant percentage of actions and conversions can be lost due to this. It is recommended to place the pixel code early in the web page, preferably just before the closing head tag in HTML. Pixel is not the only conversion. It is not a best practice to load multiple conversion events on a single page. This will result in inefficient optimization and tracking of these conversion events. Instead, using a single conversion pixel across all ads tracking or optimizing for this event, in the case that a secondary conversion event occurs based on person's interaction with the web page, then this warning can be ignored.